Hi, I'm Chris Millette, a singer-songwriter from Los Angeles, and welcome to Breaking Down, World of Fantasy. And I drew my truth back to the mainland of our In this segment, I'll be telling you about how we recorded World of Fantasy. So, we recorded World of Fantasy, like the whole album, um, in my longtime friend Medicine's Garage. Um, and he uses the Logic music production software. So, um, first we recorded the guitars, um, the rhythm guitar part, um, and we use this guitar right here. So, you know, this part. So, I played that and he recorded it. Um, yeah, I don't have a lot of the technical um, knowledge of, you know, how we recorded it, but, you know, Medicine recorded that. So I think then we recorded the vocals, um, which were straightforward. Um, then we did the synth sounds and the um, cello sounds, and we recorded those using the M-Audio Oxygen 49 MIDI keyboard. Um, this is not Medicine's, but I enjoyed using his, so I got myself one. And I played the synth sounds you hear and that cello sound you hear as well. Yeah, so as we were layering the tracks, it was really exciting to hear um, the sounds that I was hearing in my head, um, but to hear them um, kind of laid out on a track all together with my voice behind it. It was really cool and exciting. Another thing that's cool, um, in addition to just getting the ideas out, um, is that it sparks new ideas sometimes. So um, after, you know, hearing those tracks layered up, um, I came up with that um, lead guitar part you hear, the Yeah, so that was a new element that um, I added in there. Throughout the album, I wanted to include a lot of natural sounds, so acoustic guitars, um, you know, acoustic pianos, cellos, th those types of sounds. Um, and it's interesting that kind of as the album progresses, you know, it kind of moves from this singer-songwriter to indie rock um, to more hip-hop influenced. Um, so I believe we... Um, circled back after doing some songs to do the drums and kind of knowing that it had that progression um, but then I just decided yeah we'll go ahead and just use the program drums on this song um, and I think that gives it I mean it's like a folk rock song but I think those program drums kind of give it like a modern eclectic feel on it and World of Fantasy isn't the only song we use the program drums on, um, but after using them on um, maybe some of the more hip-hop influenced songs, I think um, I felt fine with including them on this acoustic kind of folk rock song. Yeah, I wanted the album to have a band feel um, because I was anticipating and, you know, still am, but I wanted to record it so that in the future a band could um, perform it with me. Um, but, yeah, as we were recording the songs, I realized that, you know, and I thought about it that, you know, there are studio versions and then there are live versions, so um, I felt fine with including the, the program drums. One thing that's kind of interesting about um, how we came up with those drums, so he, Medicine, played them on the MIDI keyboard that I showed you um, and I kind of guided him with the sound that I wanted. Um, I was trying to just, and then for the chorus, I had this idea of having like a, like a, like a, a crashing sound in it. And as I was trying to describe it to him, it like hit me like, oh, like the, that crashing sound in Drake's karaoke, which is a classic, by the way. Um, so yeah, I thought that was kind of interesting and cool. 
Um, and we just found the, the song, the sound in, in Logic. Um, also, Medicine, um, he did the Shakers um, and recorded them. And of course, Medicine mixed and mastered the song as well, which is awesome. And I'm grateful to him for all his work. So if you have any questions about how um, we recorded World of Fantasy, please let me know in the comments below. Please subscribe so that you don't miss future episodes of Breaking Down, even when I didn't realize. Thanks for watching.